Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Pokemon X and Wow Wow Battle Battle Rank number so number 17. Alright, um, as explained on the last video, I'm using this team for the last time, and the last time is today. So, I'm saying not tomorrow, because tomorrow I'm gonna be starting my ass off on exam for school, because it's the finals week and kind of like that, but you know what? I'm almost done. I'm done next Tuesday. So, because of that. Thursday will, will be my next upload, and um, since I'm going to switch teams, um, I'm gi I'll give you a hint as, as to what my next team is going to be. Since this is my first generation team, what do you think Thursday's team is going to be? Yeah, um, put that in the comment below, and on, on top of that, penetrate that like button, because, 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 um, the space making right there in the corner um, will find you, and uh, will kill you, pretty much, yeah. Sure, so you guys are watching this video, you guys can't escape from the wrath of the space monkey. Alright, let's go. We're gonna find somebody right now. At the junction of all junctures, let's do it. Come on. Yeah. Alright, if the service can just not, not um go so slow, that'd be that'd be fine. That'd be good times. Come on. I know the the, the battle ranking system just got up and running new. It's a clean slate. The rating is gonna be a clean slate. 1500 right now it's gonna be good times I'm gonna go against Romain he's gonna say yo and I'm gonna say what's up man you're from France that's good times hopefully you guys have a Pokemon Center there in the future cuz I heard news about you guys gonna have a Pokemon Center temporarily for like three days but that'd be good times <laughs> Woo! I was right out of breath there that'd be good that'd be good Romain I like that ring I got I like that ring Romain that's good that's good good times he might see my Charizard coming I'm definitely gonna see that Greninja there first so with that I think it's more beneficial to bring in Blastoise because I did make us one small change and that is to switch the Assault Vest off that Blastoise and put a Mega on it because usually I would bring either Charizard or Blastoise so I have two Megas here but the decision of what I want to bring I can see him going for Calvancho which actually will put a huge damper on my team so because of that I'm actually gonna bring Charizard instead and then also bring in Venusaur as well. And uh, despite that fact, I don't care whatever he's gonna bring, I'm gonna bring in Mankey. So Charizard, it's gonna be my thing. First, Venusaur, then Mankey, the Space Mankey, because I haven't used him in the past two episodes and I did say in the first, uh, the first, uh, what's it called? The first time I used this team, I said I was gonna bring the Space Mankey on the second one, but I didn't! So, I, I, I totally forgot about that, so I'm gonna bring the Mankey to you, because I was, last episode I was just focusing on winning. So, I'm gonna go against Remain. Almost, just, just like 10% not giving a fuck, but I do give a fuck about winning here for you guys, so let's go! We're gonna try! I definitely knew that I was gonna bring the Gavantulers there. <laughs> I don't know what I just said, but... <laughs> I knew that he was gonna bring Gavantula, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make evolve and protect, protect actually in Charizard's case. If you're bringing in something that can actually speed up, like chlor chlorophyll, it's good to have protect on the Charizard just to have the sun up, because you don't want to take in that damage in the first turn. So that's beneficial for me. I don't think this guy's gonna be sticky whip, but if he is, then that might hurt a little bit on my Venusaur. But other than that, nothing else really. He's gonna T wave. Okay, that is something. I don't want that to happen. However, I don't think I have anything to protect against it, really. Except for Mankey. But, uh, he was, uh, Mankey will still get paralyzed, so I don't want that either. <laughs> and I definitely don't want Venusaur there because it outspeeds everything in sight. And I, I think I do need this Charizard as far as the speed goes. So because of that, I'm gonna... <laughs> I really don't want to bring Mankey here just to take this up, but you know what? I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Mankey, you gotta take this T-Wave like a boss right now. You gotta do it. He probably knows that I can't I can't take a heat, uh, Thunder Wave unless I brought Pikachu. And he does go for the T-Wave again. It sucks that my mascot's gonna take this T-Wave. It really sucks, but at the same time, I do pack in the Focus Satch, which is why. Which is why I had to bring in Mankey, because it was my best bet. So because of that, I can predict them to switch out or not either way I'm gonna rock to him just to lower the speed if possible lower the speed or he might just go for the volt switch either way rock to him will be beneficial unless I don't get the parahax unless I do get the parahax then that'll be bad times he does switch out a hard switch out okay what are you gonna go for I don't know okay then finally that is fine I wish I would have gone for the u-turn other than that um, I'm, I'm basically good I can actually go for a hard switch protect my focus sash 
because I don't think this, uh, what do you, what do you, what do you call it, the new fairy type Sil Sylveon, I doubt it'll have anything to do with some harm against my Venusaur, because sometimes they, they pack in the Toxic, which Venusaur will pack a huge uh, defensive wall against, it's immune to it, that's good times, so I'm going to hard switch, protect my Focus Sash, don't know if the Parahax will go through whenever I bring in a Mankey, if I bring in Mankey again, I don't know, but here's good, okay, he goes for the Reflect, that does not really matter to me, because my Mankey is, it, it is physically offensive, but my two top guys are going to be Venusaur and Charizard, but I might bring in the Mankey as to just finish things off, but I don't know if the Reflect will still be there by then. But, his first Pokemon was, whatchamacall, the dang Gavantula Spider thingy, but I don't think he'll take in the Sludge Bomb very well either, so, best choice to go for Sludge Bomb. I'm gonna kill this Sylveon, I don't know why he's doing it, just laying this, okay, look at that, takes it in like a champ. You got a Moonblast, I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know how, that's a pitiful damage, pitiful, pitiful damage. The sun fades, which kinda sucks. It kind of does. So here's what I'm going to do. Here's my proposition. I'm going to actually switch out. I know I can outspeed it. However, I do want my Venusaur with the sun up. So because of that, I'm actually just going to go. I'm going to do this following right now. I'm going to do it. I'm going to go with Charizard to get the sun up. He might not see it coming, he might switch out just to protect the Sylveon, because it's dang bulky as hell, but I can I, I can tell now that my Venusaur is probably going to be the trump card here, and his third Pokemon probably is going to be Greninja. I, I'm betting my butt on it, but I don't know, it, anything can happen. He's going to go for a Calm Mind, which is, I guess, okay, because I can take any hits from the Sylveon, and my Charizard is just a perfect match for it, so because of that, Mm, it's gonna be good times. I'll, I'm actually better this way than with the Venusaur. If he decides to switch out to Galvantula, that'd be better too. I mean, just sack it off, you know? Sack it off. That'd be fine. I'm gonna go for just to save Flamethrower. I wish I could have gotten overheat, just kill it right in. But you know what? Flamethrower is the safest bet, so I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. Come on. That's it. It's almost over. Um, but the Moonblast is gonna come in. That is fine, I guess. But here's the thing. He gets the special attack drop, which really, I don't think matters, really. But, um, yeah, because of that, I'm gonna go actually switch out to Venusaur. It's gonna take in that plus one Moonblast, even though it's not effective. But, it is possibly the best, uh, solution against, uh, the switch into the Gavantula. So because of that, I'm gonna have to take this in, and it's probably gonna do probably like 30 damage. Yeah, it does a lot more than I thought. Wow, 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 okay. It does a little bit more than I thought. Just a little bit more. So because of that, okay, the Reflect is off. That is fine. I'm actually gonna go for a Synthesis just to recover a little bit. Just trying to be on the safe side. I think I got this in the bag. And I'm glad that the Reflect is gone, but he might go to the Reflect this time, which is kind of weird, but... He, but he knows that I'm more specially offensive, so he does not go to reflect, so that is a good strategy on his part. Hopefully I don't get the special attack drop. Okay, I do. I do. Of course. Yep. Special attack drop when when I don't need it. When it's the worst possible time. Yeah, that's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. I'm going to sludge bomb. Can I get a crit? Because I don't think I'll be able to kill it now. I won't be able to with the, with the special defense boost and the special attack drop. That just sucks. Yeah, definitely not gonna kill it this time, but can I get a poison? No, okay, 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 I see how you roll. So, at this rate, I, I gotta switch out. Yeah, this is... that... wow, again! Again. The sunlight fades again. Okay. So... This is... this is bad. Really bad. I gotta go for... this time, uh, I'm just gonna sludge bomb it. I'm just gonna do it. Wow, I took in way too much damage than I had to. Way too much. So because of that, I'm gonna have to... I, as much as I really don't want to, I might I might have to consider sacking off Mankey. My mascot Mankey has to probably be Sacrificial Lamb here. I really don't want to do that, but it looks like that's what I'm gonna have to do in order to win this, because I just took in way too much. Mega Volt, that's gonna... Okay, so it's gonna be Miguel Vancho. I totally forgot the nickname that he put on the thing, but who cares? You know what? All right. For this little booger, this piece of compound chicken. Um, I'm thinking that last Pokemon's probably gonna be Greninja, so 
I'm going all out just based on that. So because of that, my manky is because it's paralyzed. It's just a waste, a huge waste. He might go for a T-Way, predicting me to go to Charizard just to sack it off or something. Hopefully he does go for the T-Way, but I don't think that's gonna happen. He might just go for a Bug Buzz, probably if it's the safest bet. But I, I can't do anything. I gotta sack off this thing as much as I don't want to. He's gonna T-Way. That's good. That's good. That's fine. That is good. I'm gonna go for, okay, I pack into Close Combat Rock 2, Mewturn, and Ice Punch. <laughs> There's no reason for him to go and to a switch, so I'm gonna just go for a Rock Tomb. I'm just gonna do it. I should live anything. I don't care if you got the Compound Ice on there, but I'm gonna live because I got the Focus Sash, and that's gonna definitely bring me to 1 HP. That's fine. Okay, as long as Mankey gets the damage off, that's good. I land it, that's fine. That's fantastic, look at that rocks, man. That takes half. Mankey, you did a good job, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, you got the speed. Speed drop, that is all he asked for because Charizard can just come in and kill that thing. That's all, that's all he, that's mission accomplished for the Mankey, that's it. Energy ball, that is fine. I don't know why he went for that because I, I would've gotten the resistance if I switched out, so it's not a good play there. But either way, he's still killing Manky nevertheless, so it doesn't really that matter that much. In actuality, I'm gonna go to Charizard, that's fine. That's good times. He got the speed drop. That means I can outspeed. I'm gonna get the drought. That's gonna be good times. And uh, we're gonna be in summer, so might as well bring this on for you guys. For you guys. That's what I'm doing for you guys. I'm gonna go. Hmm. At this rate, I don't think it really matters. But I can just. I guess I can go for a Rock Tomb. Predicting him to switch out, which probably is a good idea. But I don't think I'll be able to kill this guy with the Rock Tomb because I am actually timid. So that's the one thing I do fear. So I'm gonna just go for the same flea thrower. But if he's smart, he's just gonna withdraw. So I wish I went for the Rock Tomb. But um, yeah, okay. So he's gonna go for a haircut. He's gonna suck it off. That is okay with me, unless he is he is uh, focus sashed. Is he Sash? No, he's gonna suck it off. Okay. So that, I think that just pretty much secures my victory, nevertheless. So I guess that is fine. Uh, yeah. He can just go for his Thunder if he wants to. Um, uh, that's what I'm thinking he's gonna go to. So, I think I have this in the bag. I don't know if Bug resists poison. I'm not sure, actually. So, I don't think. Yeah, I should know this already, but uh, <laughs> but I'm just gonna go and I guess sack this off. So I'm gonna go for probably a flamethrower if I can just survive. But you know what? He's gonna go for thunder. And he void. Oh my god, he misses. That is game right there, ladies and gentlemen. I feel bad for that guy, but at the same time, you know what? You went for the thunder, and you should have kind of landed with the combine eyes, but not really because it's not 100% accurate. But you know what? Screw you guys, screw you, but you did play well, you did play well, because I predicted you to go and switch out, and that was a good play of you, but, yeah, that's, that's unfortunate for you, I don't know why you brought in Heracross too, since I had that freaking Charizard there, did you not predict me to go to Charizard, but he could the best thing he could have had for a third Pokemon is actually, possibly Greninja, since the Protean would have helped him, but, you know what, that's how he wanted to choose, that's how he rolled, that's gonna be 20 and 4, so, there you go, that's Mankey for you guys, setting up for everybody else to do the work for him. That's what I'm talking about. He is the boss, he is the honcho. That is his role. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to leave a like below. Penetration of four likes is the goal, ladies and gentlemen. With that said, expect a new video with a new team Thursday. Comments below whether you, what kind of team do you think it is. As, as that, obviously my same, I have to look up, buddy, ciao, ciao, ciao.